Hello friends, welcome back to 7 Days to Die with your host Rongo the Bigger. So I have decided to kind of continue... Okay, this is where it gets scary. Continue the building of uh, a more secure environment. I got a bunch of rebar frames put together. Had some in, yeah, I had, you guys know, you guys have seen the extra, the excess of uh, everything. Okay, let me get these out of here. That one's already got. All right, let me do this. Chap lips. That's that's gonna be interesting. If I talk about my mouth like this, so I don't get ripped up lip you saying You know what I mean? Might make for interesting commentary. Alright. So yes, I decided to go ahead and just well I'm tired of fixing up the divots that are left behind every time a zombie horde comes through. So I taking matters into my own hands. Holy sh shit! Oh, I thought for sure. I thought for sure the whole thing was coming down. I thought I had just screwed the pooch in the largest of ways there, <laughs> and I'm glad that I had you guys on camera. When that happened. Because holy crap. Oh. I just, yeah, I have to change my shorts now. At least a strange that it just broke off halfway down. That is strange. Okay. Uh, let's, let's do this. I don't think these things have much structural integrity, but, you know, maybe it'll all help out. And this is same basic deal here. Oh, no, that's too deep. That is too deep. Okay. So I need to go kind of here, here. Ouch. And there. And I guess I'll do the same thing. One, two, three here. So this is going to be a, a, an episode of building. Building constructions. Wrong of the builder. Perfect. Okay, now let's do more scariness. Very nervous making doing this. I don't know why I'm doing it. I should leave that center one unconcreted, but I feel more completionisty. <laughs> Is that a word? It's a word now, damn it. If I actually go ahead and uh, do it, I just need a few more I used to do. Oh, God. It's... Oh, God. Care about the fertile dirt. Just care about. I've actually found it's it's easier and faster to dig dirt with a flawless shovel than it is with the auger. Be 
because it just goes it's one it's always one hit and it's quieter and easier to target exactly what it is you want to destroy okay then we'll go back and clear all clear all these others up when we're Clear, clear, clear. Okay, this side. All right. No surprise hordes today. I'm just not sure what where that, what that horde was for. I guess it must have been just a wandering horde. But. Uh, Lion Horde followed by poor decision making makes for fun. Oops. Okay, you need to be done. You need to be done. I guess we can just do it way right across right now. Okay. And then I want to do the ramp. Oh, so much. Okay, yeah. I keep thinking, like, oh, there's nothing to do. But now it's basically like clean up and fix up and polishing and getting all of our ducks properly rowed, rowed up and put away. I don't need the worms. Okay, that's all good. Ouch. Don't we gotta watch my health so I don't actually kill myself. That would be sadly funny. Actually, I'll put the mag in there just in case I get a surprise. Surprise guest. Okay, and some more of these. Actually, that one I gotta do first. Okay. What are you guys doing for Christmas? Just kidding. It's not Christmas yet, is it? Whew. Yeah, guess not. I've got to uh, think of some fun activity. Oh, yes, yeah, so I guess you guys were. We're doing um, a Hawaiian themed employee work, we, uh, employee week at work. And I need suggestions for office, for office appropriate games for adults to play there again workplace appropriate some sort of Hawaiian or or etc themed Polynesian themed games for adults a large groups of adults to play so if you get some suggestions let me know that'll save me having to think them up I actually do these, um, I'm, I'm, I, I feel like I'm sometimes the uh, Julie McCoy reference uh, of my office place sometimes, kind of like the person who likes to organize fun events and activities. I have, I have what are called Joe Days at work, where I celebrate things like National Donut Day or National Nacho Cheese Day or stuff like that. And... Uh, but sometimes I just can't think of things to do. Uh, oopsie daisy. 
And before I get too far here, got myself a little bit into a corner. Okay, then I can upgrade you. And then you get this. Alright, now we can get carried away. Do I have the same problem there? No, I don't. So everybody else there is upgraded. So we gotta get all of the inside ones done first. Then we can come back and get the outside lap. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Doom. Okay. Now we're going to be much more secure. We're not necessarily secure, but it's mostly for cleanup details. Because I find myself all the time when I'm cleaning up the zombie gore blocks, I'm constantly putting a hole. And then I got to go back and patch it up. And it's just like, yeah, it's aggravating. I still have a bunch out in the road. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with those guys. And I've got to respike that. So I had to go and break it all up. That one. Uh, I think I've got another stack as well of um, uh, cement mix. Oops. jerking the camera around oops that's I'm like why is it not clicking why is it not clicking I like the building aspects. Um, yeah, I don't really know why I didn't get into Minecraft with the building, but I still like the, I guess I just don't like the blockiness. Still, just don't like the blockiness. I'm trying out a couple other games. I'm trying out um, a game called uh, Rising World, which is another early access survival crafting game. Um, its drawback um, is right now it does not have any. Uh, any enemies so all of the i mean there's there's some bears but that's really the only enemy in the game so you can basically go anywhere you want to do anything you want to do and you won't get killed um which definitely takes a little bit of the scare away i was down mining and the caves are bigger than seven days die caves are uh, but there's no fear at all there's no worries there aren't collapses there are no there are no zombies or anything else that would come out and attack you. Um, so it really it's amazing how much that immediately takes uh, flavor of the game, I guess. All right, get 
all this dug up. See, I mean, it's so easy to dig a hole in the ground with this flawless. If I had a crappier shovel when I was digging up bodies, that might help, actually. Freaking, I lost, can't believe I lost 10 freaking walnuts because of stupid. I'll just run up the hill here. Raw, raw, raw. Oh. Sometimes I annoy myself with that. It's like, ah, oh. look, Rongo. I, I'm such an impulsive person. Uh, you guys have no idea. Like, I consider myself to be, um, I, I come up with my own diagnosis, impulsive obsessive. Where I will obsess about things and then impulsively just be like, oh, look, another shiny thing. And then I'll obsess about that for a while. And it usually involves uh, toys or games or books or movies or TV shows or what have you. That. These can go across. Don't need to have you there. But we do need to have you there. And you and you. And you and you. Whoops. And you and you. Ah. All right, upgrade time. And before I break it, I upgrade the fix my shovel here. Fill this back in with that. You guys say you like a little variety in your uh, episodes, so this is definitely variety. So I'm positive I've got another selection. Now I could do the uh, the you know the t the thing that that Midnight and Games are doing with the uh, um, spikes underwater, but um, oops, I don't want you. I can cover okay, and. You guys I can cover. You're already covered. Uh. Oh, you need to be. Alright. So, I need... I'll cover, if you cover spikes with, with two blocks deep of water, core blocks won't form. Um, but that, to me, is... A little too easy. So I'm going to do it the hard way. The obstinate way. I thought for sure I had more con uh, more cement mix somewhere tucked away here. Did I use it all? Or did I... Um... Perfect. That's exactly how many I needed. Or probably more. Um, yes, please. Turn all these into that. And more into gravel. Perfectos. Perfectos Avenaris. It's uh, the little known spell. Little known crafting spell. Boom, boom. And more of these. And before I forget... And screw myself. 
He's like, I can make them now. I can make flawless weapons and armor and all that kind of stuff. Speaking of, uh, I'm scrap. I could probably rebuild those at some point here. All right. Close. I don't want to be close. New. All right, so that's done, that's down, that's down. This section is all healed up. Okay, you need to be concreted. Okay, then. And I just remembered this guy over here, for our last little batch. Perfect. Yes. And we'll get these ones down here first. We can get that outer row done. the armus <gasps> I've noticed and I, I think I've said it before when there's a lot of growing or things like this um, it definitely seems to impact frame rate I'm pretty sure that every on every cycle that the game every tick the game makes the game engine makes and it's got to look at all the stuff that's growing or, 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 you know, everything that needs to be incremented really seems to lag and affect everything. I think maybe it's a threading problem or memory leak problem. There's definitely a memory leak. I go for more than two or three episodes recording um, with the software and I start getting some lag issues. Like right now I'm getting a little bit of like a bog down. But... That is just the way things go. Alright, this is the last patch of those. And we should be getting all some zombies soon. Same thing, it's always wrong. Out of wood. This is a massive floor area. Interior ones. Those are all done. Those are all done. Those are all done. I'll connect this over. Those are all done. Those are all done. Beautiful. So I'll have to get some more. Um, just general duty go. Uh, cement mix on the go perfect 
perfect. So this is, we're going to call this, what should we call this episode? Something like Concrete Dreams and Cyanide Pills. So we can come out to roughly there. I think in the next episode we'll go back. Um, I'll focus back on inside the house again. I'll finish the rest of this flooring uh, off camera. And is that a zombie? No, it was just that well, yeah, the leaf was leaning into the breeze there. That was a zombie walking forward. Yeah, that'll work. All right. Um, yeah, so I'll finish this stuff off camera. When we come back, what I'll do is we'll finish up um, the bathroom area. Um, I'll go ahead and also forge. I'll have some uh, glass mold made and some glasses made while we're off camp while we're off camera. And uh, oh, we came upstairs just in time. Oh, zombies. I hope at some point that the uh, they implement that UMA zombie skin so that the zombies are different looking. Cause it, it is kind of boring sometimes seeing the same you know same zombie run by a bazillion times. Now they just run around like, oh, it's happening. We heard noises. We totally heard noises. All right, friends. If you like it, click that like button, comment, subscribe. Tell your friends, your family, and your grandma. And like I said, we're going down to five episodes. So just Monday through Friday this week. So don't expect a Saturday, Sunday one coming up. And uh, yes, tell me suggestions for Hawaiian themed adults. Not adults. Sorry. Take it back. Office. Uh, space style games to do at a workplace. All right, bye bye.